Welcome to Nordic Viola's Histories and Her Histories, a programme of music by women composers from and about the North Atlantic. This concert is produced in conjunction with Orkney International Science Festival and the University of the Highlands and Islands Institute of Northern Studies. Women's music has always featured really strongly in our programmes, so it's a real delight to present this programme of music that explores stories of motherhood and leadership and also views the landscapes of the North Atlantic through the eyes of women composers. So without further ado, I'll introduce you to our first composer, Shetland fiddler, Margaret Robertson. I think that uh, traditionally Shetland fiddling was very much the mantle of the, the male. Uh, and it really was through the tuition in schools that it became a, a sort of equal playing field. Um, it was of course historically expected that the women would be the knitters and the family, building the family home, um, working on the craft, and it was the men that would that would play. But I think, as I say, that when the lessons became available in school, that gave that sort of level playing field for girls and boys to, to pick up the fiddle and play. And in actual fact, it's almost swung a full 360 that, that most of the players in Shetland now are young girls and, and women. Um, I know from my work with Hjalti Bonhoga, they're often referred to as my girls because there's so few men involved that they hardly get, get noticed. Mother's Love was written following the death of a son of one of my friends, Sharon McKelvey. Sharon had one child, Rory. Um, Rory basically died uh, of heart issues that they knew nothing about. Mother's Love is dedicated to Sharon and to Rory. But in actual fact, I had just recently had a visit from my mother. One of my friends was heavily pregnant and about to give birth. And it just made me think of all the different aspects of being a mother and the fact that despite losing her son, she will always be a mother. <laughs> 